For the residents who live along Ukraine's eastern border with Russia, the sad reality of a country in turmoil. The house shook and we spent all night in the basement. Families forced to pack up and leave their homes to escape the fighting. This week, the Mikolov family picked up the bare essentials and left the pro-Russian stronghold of Slovyansk for safer ground. The city's self-declared mayor urged residents to leave this week as the fighting escalates. I have four children and we are very scared to stay here. We are afraid for their lives. Civilians are often caught in the exchange of fire between Russian separatists and Ukrainian troops fighting to save their country from breakup. Some rooms sit empty at the General Hospital in Slovyansk after a mortar was shot through the main wall. But according to Ukraine's acting defense minister, some progress is being made south of Slovyansk. Our military units have cleaned up the separatists in southern and western parts of the Donetsk region and north of the Luhansk region. The announcement comes just one day after a devastating blow to Ukraine's army. Rebels shot down a helicopter, killing 12 soldiers outside Slovyansk. Yansk, a loss underscoring the challenges forces face in fighting this guerrilla-style insurgency. Robert Bumstead, Associated Press.